climbing out back into Wisconsin. You can see we're not done yet. We still have some storm chances. Chicago area, we've got that risk continuing into lower Michigan, then around Grand Rapids and Detroit uh, into your overnight hours. Now, Wednesday, we pick it up in Michigan. Also now Ohio stretching through Pennsylvania back into southern New England. We've got the chance of thunderstorms as well. So let's first look at Green Bay, where for us, it starts even early tomorrow morning with that chance of thunderstorms. So keeping an eye on these throughout the day chances. Um, what's nice is that it's not organizing. That's yeah, exactly. Yes. Exactly. We'll take the rain yeah. and you know, it keeps us a little coolish. Right. Coolish. I'll put that in well, quotes. Speaking <laughs> of cold, how about this? Right. This is a this. We know Houston and a lot of rainfall. Not a good look. <laughs> right. Not exactly. a good look. Exactly. So we'll keep an eye on that. No doubt about it. As we head through the next several days, dealing with that risk for more rain showers and thunderstorms here along the Gulf Coast. Well, we move from rain and storms to snow. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, snow in August. Here, um, we're still generally thinking afternoon travel is worse right. than morning, but you know, you just you can't rule out. If you like this morning, Port St. Lucie getting clocked with heavy rain. Exactly. So yeah, just to be safe. Check with the airlines. Yeah. Florida thunderstorms, always hard to forecast. Yes. Always. Mm -hmm. Snow in the mountains, but, you know, it's still tropical moisture in place. So, yeah. we, you know, can shake that. It is August. <laughs> exactly. No doubt about it. But it does keep us at least, you get brief breaks from the heat, at least when you get yeah, some more. That's, true. that's uh, true. But then, of course, if the sun comes out, yeah. it gets brutal. Steamy. Mm -hmm. uh, you know what? It gives you.